Bueno dia! Welcome to Spanaki Bar! Today, we in Mexico! We just had 15 pina colada! It was awesome! Yo, I say, get up! We have more to drink! Yo, man, you okay? Man. So today, we're gonna start the video off with seven interesting facts. Yes! Seven interesting facts you could tell all of your friend. <laughs> and I'm gonna show you how to possibly recover a potentially stolen smartphone. Are you ready for Dick? You no. Bookkeeper is the only word in the English language with three consecutive double letters. On average, by the age of 60, most people have lost half of their taste buds. Alexander Graham Bell, the inventor of the telephone, never phoned his wife or his mother because they were both <laughs> The ever so famous fruit, the banana, grows pointing upwards. No! no. Urine glows under a black light. The owl is the only bird that can turn its head 270 degrees around. Tiger shark embryos fight each other in the womb of their mother. Therefore, the surviving embryo is the one that's born. So you're at the bar, dancing with your ladies. You reach down, you notice your phone is gone. And then lo and behold, the lump in your pants is gone. What do you do? If you have an iPhone or a Blackberry, these following tips may come in handy for y'all. Now for the iPhone users, I'm sure each and every one of you already knows this, but there's an app out there called Find My iPhone. All you gotta do is register your phone, thus if it gets stolen or lost at a bar, you can go online, find out where it is, or you can completely wipe the device. Find My iPhone. Now for the Blackberry users, call it. Most likely they're probably gonna turn it off or take out the SIM card. If that happens, you're fucked. <laughs> The following week after the event of having your phone stolen, go on websites like Kijiji, eBay, anything that will allow you to check people selling goods in your area. Find an ad that sounds like your phone, or probably the most sketchiest ad, text a seller and ask for the BBM pin. The BBM pin is unique to each phone, therefore you can't change that. And if the pin matches, it's your phone! So that completes a second episode of Pelican Bus. And I'm sure by now you guys are just itching for more. I know I am. <laughs> so if you haven't clicked the yellow subscribe button, just go ahead and click it right now. Please. I walk around with this thing on me all day long. So all day. Least you can use click it. Might as well. Peace and love, my friends. Peace and love. So good. Wow. Today we in Mexico. No, we're not. <laughs> welcome to Pelican Bus. Yo, welcome to Mexico. <laughs> I said, oh, we just had a 15 pina colada. No, we did it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Seven interesting facts. Nice. We could even let you guys tell. Let me. <laughs> What's going on with that? Okay. No. No. <laughs> no. no. Oh no, it's so cute. So <laughs> There's a leaf in it or something. <laughs> That's cute. That's why you need braids, oh, honey. It's in my mouth. <laughs> that, looks like, that looks like an ass hair.